Oracle Digital Assistant integrated with the ERP Cloud. This lab walks you through registering a demo using a Fusion Apps demo title that already has an integrated Oracle Digital Assistant environment. From there, you will be able to interact with the Digital Assistant through the perspective of a finance manager and a new hire. In the first part, we are going to request an ERP Cloud instance. To do this, we must log in to Demo Central. Once the environment has been approved, you will receive an email from Demo Central. This will have a link where you can access your registration details and environment information. Make sure to save the access details and copy the password as we will be using it in the next part. Please note that environment password will change weekly. You will be taken to the sign-in page for your ERP instance. Here, you can sign in with a few different users using the same password. But in this workshop, we will be exploring mainly two different personas. In order to interact with the digital assistant, we need to navigate to the ERP Cloud sign-in page like we did in the last step. From here, you are going to enter the username kerry.lane and the environment password you copied earlier. Once logged in, you will notice the digital assistant icon located at the bottom right hand corner of the page. Click on the digital assistant icon and you will notice that the digital assistant has initiated the conversation with the finance manager. The first thing we are going to showcase is creating an expense report within the digital assistant. In the chat window of the digital assistant, type in food expenses $15.46. The digital assistant recognizes that the user wants to create a new expense report and will prompt the user to enter a few more details. The digital assistant will prompt you to enter the merchant's name, enter your favorite place to eat, the date of expense, enter a date of your choice, the category of the expense, select a breakfast. Once all the details have been filled in, the digital assistant confirms the expense line creation but we would like to update the description. To um, update the description type in description is lunch. Confirm your expense by entering the number given in the digital assistant's response. One other way to create an expense report in a digital assistant is to upload an image of a receipt. The digital assistant uses Keywords scanned from the images fill in the expense field. Upload the image by selecting the icon to the left of the chat box and navigate to where you downloaded the sample receipt and upload. The digital assistant will ask you to enter the expense type and then select lunch. The digital assistant will give you a summary of the expenses and ask you to confirm by entering the confirmation code in the last message sent by the digital assistant. To change the date of the expense submitted, type in modify the last expense. Type in change date to last Tuesday. Digital assistant recognizes the current date through natural language processing, then saves the change and automatically submits the new expense. Confirm by entering the confirmation code in the last message sent from the digital assistant. The digital assistant was able to retry data from the ERP's financement module to create, retrieve and update an expense report. Before we switch to the next persona, click the top right icon and then click on sign out. Make sure you are at the ERP Cloud login page. Enter the username brian.joseph and the password provided or copied earlier in the workshop.
Now we are going to switch to the perspective of a new hire. This new hire was told to procure a laptop and business cards through his employer's pre-built digital assistant that has been integrated with ERP cloud procurement module. Click on the digital assistant icon in the bottom right hand corner and type in I need a new laptop. The digital assistant will prompt you if you would like it to recommend a laptop based on your job role. Type yes. Browse what is available by clicking on yellow side arrow and select more details on your favorite option. The digital assistant will provide you with more details and ask if you would like more details on any other laptops. Type in no. The digital assistant will ask if you have made any choice. Type in yes and select the laptop you would like to procure. The digital assistant will create the purchase requisition and route the request to your manager for approval. The next thing we need to do is procure business cards. To do this, type in order business cards. The digital assistant will respond and give you a preview. Select tab here. This will open up a new tab where you can preview your business cards. Select the quantity and submit the order. Select the quantity you want to order and su select submit. Close the tab and open up the tab where you are logged into ERP Cloud. Digital Assistant will create the requisition, display the status of the order and give you the requisition number. Follow the steps in the workshop guide on how to install on iOS or Android mobile device uh, the application and uh, Oracle's AI voice. In this portion of workshop, we are going to get a few updates on the finance manager's account. You can interact with the ODA by typing in the chat box or by clicking the microphone icon in the bottom right. Press the microphone button and say what is the account balance for cleaning. Press the microphone button and say how much do we owe our supply, suppliers of East Depot. Press the microphone button and say which account has the largest budget surplus. Press the microphone button again and say which project has the highest margins. Oracle's digital assistant provides broad channel support like Slack, Teams, SMS, mobile applications, text-to-speech, and speech-to-text capabilities. In this portion of the workshop, Oracle AI Voice is being used with no risky exposure to third-party APIs. In this lab, you requested a demo, ERP Cloud Instance, and interacted with the pre-built Digital Assistant skill for ERP. Oracle Digital Assistant pre-built skills showcase easy, interactive, intuitive and meaningful information without the need to log in and open ERP applications. To learn more, please watch the other lab walkthroughs in this Passport SAS workshop.